Good morning. Kern here. Just going through a little bit of the morning routine. Still dark out, but while they sleep, we work. Trying to get better every day. Now the journey. I want to get the discussion going today about time and the value of time. Everyone values their time differently, but the quicker we find what our value of time means to us, the quicker we can explain that to other people. And if we don't value our time, other people won't value our time. That's one thing I've learned through life. So continuing with time, one is once it's lost, it can't be regained. Uh, you can never regain that time that you lost. Uh, if you slept in, if you missed an opportunity, you can never regain that. Someone may give you that through the goodness of their own heart, but they don't have to. So that's one thing that I've learned through life as well. Um, and it is the most valuable asset time is. Time is the most valuable asset that we as human beings have. And I've just found myself trying to value and appreciate the time going through all of this and spend it wisely, not only with your loved ones, but even with your friends uh, and your associates. If you're not spending your time wisely, you can invest that somewhere else and you can actually benefit from that being invested somewhere else. Whether it is working out, whether it is studying, there's so many other things that we can do as human beings, but yet we let time and the opportunity slip through our fingers. Uh, next, I would say we can go, it can go slowly time can actually be stand still or feel like it's standing still. And that's when I find you're actually living in the moment when you're not rushing, you're enjoying the time where you actually are. But also, as I said before, with wasting it, you can just let it slip away, which is very sad. It's bit sad to see in life. It's sad to see in other people. Um, that's one thing I've actually been striving for is to be better with my time. And so I find out creating a task list, things that I want to do for the day works out very, very well for me in terms of achieving something. And that was one thing that my dad always told me is be happy for achieving something every single day. And you'll be surprised how far you can actually get through achieving those things. Not only achieving things of material fact, something that you're happy that you accomplished, maybe a project, creating something, woodwork, not only the fact that you actually created something or you've done something with that time, but there's a sense of accomplishment in that you can move to the next task and that you don't have to come back to this, uh, that you've done it correctly the first time or you've done it correctly in the time that you allocated to it. So there is value there. Another thing is valuing your time. If you actually paid people to spend that time with you, number one, how much do you think they would pay to spend that time with you? How much do you think? Or if you had to spend that time with somebody else, how much would you pay to spend that time with somebody else? And lastly, time is not promised. Today is not promised. Tomorrow is not promised. Don't put off till tomorrow what you can do today. <laughs>